The Titans look to bounce back from the top loss against the Washington State Cougars. Brian Lewis would make his first time of the year against Cougars fellas. Matted up at three. Cougars had the base blood, but Jason Mallow is going to start out here for the first out. Brian Lewis with seven strikeouts for the game. And then, next battle up, Mendenhall is going to fly out to J.D. Davis. The team is going to challenge him, but Davis will not probably out at the point. He's going to go and tie it off the lead. He's going to talk to Davis for some pieces that will get away from T.J. Jones, allowing Timmy Richards to score the game. He goes down to their last strike. Colin Slayback gets this single to tie the game, giving Washington State New left. Deacon has a chance to be with her as with a start down at Pass Mountain Hall, and this will score Greg Velasquez. The Titans go ahead and squeeze in the game, tie the floor, Deacon in the floor, the Titans win the game, and the series over the Cougars. Um, you know, I thought we grinded out some at bats uh, good late in the game. Uh, I thought Phil and Pitesy and JD and Willie all did a good job. Um, so, you know, it was a good team win for us right there. I mean, that was, I'll take a W. Uh, I think one thing I did well was uh, pound the strike zone early. Um, those guys are free swingers and they're good hitters. So uh, the more I pounded early, hopefully they'd get themselves out. He told me just to grind out my bat. I mean, I'm not a power hitter or anything, so I just try to shoot line drive somewhere, but capped a ball, so it got through a hole. It was nice. A great gritty performance from Graham Weist and a huge walk-off victory helps the Titans bounce back from a tough loss. And they take two out of the three from Washington State. They have a road game against USC, and then they'll be back here for a series against San Francisco. From Goodwin Field, Colin Yee, Titans Sports Recap.